In Minnesota, all children have the right to receive a free early childhood screening starting at age three. All children must be screened before entering kindergarten in a public school. Early childhood screening is not an IQ test, a label, a diagnosis, or a placement test. Early childhood screening is a quick, simple check of children's health and development using standardized tools. Children should have regular well-child screenings or child and teen checkups from the time they are born throughout their childhood and teen years. Early childhood screening is a special type of screening involving observation of how your child is growing and developing. Early childhood screening has three purposes, to promote healthy development, to identify children who may need further health or developmental evaluation, and to connect families to resources in the community. In Minnesota, early childhood screening is provided by all public school districts, Head Start programs, and some medical clinics. During early childhood screening, you can expect your child to participate in a few different screening activities. The screening staff will check to make sure your child's physical development is on track. The screener will also check your child's vision and hearing. Your child will have the chance to do activities that show how he or she is developing. These activities are designed to be fun and familiar for children, including things like building with blocks, standing on one foot, and drawing shapes. Some of the screening activities, such as repeating a sentence, help you understand how your child is doing in building skills needed to learn to read. Children usually enjoy showing what they know, and if they are shy or distracted, screening staff work hard to make the child feel comfortable. You can always reschedule for another day if your child is not feeling well. At the end of the screening, the staff will take the time to connect with you and share information about how your child is developing. If there are any areas where a child could use more support, the screening staff help connect families with resources in the community. I took my son to get his early childhood screening right after his third birthday. It was his first time in a school building and I could tell he was a little nervous at first. But once the screening got started, he actually had fun. When the screening was done, the staff took time to walk me through the results and I was glad to hear he was right on track. They asked me if he was in childcare and I told them I recently got laid off and couldn't afford childcare right now. They gave us a referral to apply for an early learning scholarship and we were approved. He's now in a four-star family childcare program in our neighborhood and he's doing great. I am so happy to know he's going to be ready for kindergarten next year. During her early childhood screening, my daughter really struggled with the vision screening. She was only three and it hadn't ever occurred to me that she wasn't seeing very well. The screener suggested we take her to her pediatrician's office to get another vision test. We did that and found out she needed glasses. Once she got them, it was amazing how right away she started asking about letters on signs. Mama, S for stop, S for snake. She was so excited to get to kindergarten and learn how to read big kid books. Ever since she was a baby, my granddaughter Jordan has been a handful. When she was three and started daycare, even her daycare provider had a tough time managing her. Once she got upset about something, which was all the time, she just couldn't calm herself down and no one else could either. Her daycare provider told us about early childhood screening, so I took Jordan in to get screened at our local school district. They referred us to early childhood special education, where they did some more screening and said Jordan was eligible for services. I had no idea that our family had the right to free service that could make such a difference in Jordan's behavior. They even come to her daycare twice a week and give her one-on-one -on -one support. They are also teaching her daycare provider, me, and her parents how to provide her with the support she needs to focus on having fun and learning. We are so grateful that we took her in for screening so she can get the help she needs before she starts kindergarten next year. As part of the screening, parents may be referred to other early care and education opportunities like pre-K programs, Head Start, public health home visiting, early childhood family education, or early learning scholarships. The ideal age for screening is three years old, but the most important thing is that children receive their screening before entering kindergarten. By getting your child screened at age three or as close to three as possible, you can ensure that your child gets access to all the resources he or she needs to be on track for success in kindergarten and beyond. This video was made possible through support from Learn Together MN, a project of the Greater Twin Cities United Way and the McKnight Foundation.